Hello, I'm starting this vlog early. It's Wednesday morning, it's the 17th of June, and I thought I'd film today and tomorrow rather than at the weekend because my last one was a bit late. So I felt really, really bad because it was a couple of hours late. So I thought I'd film early, get it edited and ready, and then um, we're having friends over on Saturday again. So I thought um, I would just get it filmed before Saturday because it's, it's probably easier and then you get a vlog. For Sunday at 8 so I hope you're okay um, it is yeah it's Wednesday morning the weather is kind of nice today it's sunny but it's a bit kind of cloudy you might be able to hear Rufus he is snoring he's on my dressing gown having a little snore and I just filmed a home bargains haul for Wednesday so I just filmed that it's not a massive one like last time it's just like a, a normal size one but I had found such lovely things I thought I'd just film a quick haul and I put on I know people have been interested in the different lashes, which you'll see in the Home Bargains haul. I've got these ones on today, these um, Home Bargains ones, which you might have seen in my huge Home Bargains haul from the other day. And these were £2.49 each and they're pre-glued. So I just shoved them on. And I wasn't sure at first, I didn't know if they looked a bit much, but I think they look, um, they look really quite nice. Do you want a gravy bone? Oh, your hair looks lovely, Rufus. He's running upstairs again. And I've just taken the lashes off because I just thought I'd keep them nice and put them back in the packaging. I've got on just some normal mascara. I'm wearing this dress again. I keep wearing these dresses. They're ASOS ones and they were a pound each and they're just really comfortable. So it's kind of just past the knee, like t-shirt jersey material. And when I think, well, what shall I wear? I'll just chuck these back on because they're so comfy. So yeah, this is what I'm wearing. Was that nice, Rufus? Was that a nice gravy bone? Hello. I've repotted this, I'm just outside and I repotted this rose, this little rose bush, and it seems to be doing really well in here. So it's just in a container. Actually, it needs a clean. That was only a pound from a car boot sale. I think it was last year. I planted some other stuff. I'm not sure what's here. And then these geraniums are from B&M and they were uh, three pots for six pounds. So there's three different plants. And I put them in here with some compost in these, uh, what are they called? I've forgotten the word but these containers and they were 9.99 I think they're just like plastic ones there's another here and look how lovely they're doing and I bought these um, lavender plants yesterday there's one there and this one here and they were £12.50 each from B&M and the pots were 6 99 so I thought it was really good value and the um yeah the lavender just smells amazing and I bought this lovely large container as well that was seven pound fifty down from ten because it was a bit bashed in so they gave me some money off and then i planted some lavender more lavender and these were three for five pounds for these it's kind of three plants and i put them all in together so hopefully that will grow nice and i don't know if it will flower hopefully if it, hopefully it will but i love that pot i think it's gorgeous or well, the container and I also popped a pound stretcher yesterday and just picked up only a couple of things, but I'll just quickly show you here. My friend Claire is um, 40 in a couple of weeks. So I got her a little gift bag. So I've got lots of little presents. So I'm going to put them in here and she loves flamingos. And this was 69p, a little gift bag. It's just very cute. So that was from Pound Stretcher. Some sticky tape as well. That was a pound. Oh, three reels. And this dish drying mat I got for when we wash up because we didn't have anything there and I was just ruining the tea towels. And that was £1.79 for that dish drying mat thing. And I popped into TK Maxx. I just thought I'd have a really quick look because it was open. And I saw this watch. I didn't find anything at first. And then as I was leaving, I spied this Kathy Kidston watch and thought, oh, that looks nice. And it was £16.99, reduced from 55, well, RRP 55 pounds. And I've never had a Kath Kidston watch. I just thought it was beautiful. And I thought I might never see this again. So I thought I'll go on, I'll get myself a watch. And then as I left, so I'm gonna put that on in a minute because it's just so cute. How good is that for 16.99 in a little box? And then I saw this. So I didn't get that many bargains when I was looking. I had a look in the home section and there wasn't anything. They must've all gone the day before because I went um, yesterday. So that was Tuesday. And it opened again on Monday, but that was only two pounds for this hat. And I thought that was lovely, like to wear down to the beach. And it's got kind of a blue, is that blue? Yeah, like navy blue trim. Um, well, navy blue there and then a pink trim. And I tried it on, it looks quite nice. So I thought that was brilliant. What make are you? Tom Franks, 
how good for two pounds i thought that was brilliant i was like yep i have to get that hat because it looks lovely and then i walked around to the till and i saw so many reduced easter things that i went a little bit bonkers they were one pound fifty and they're absolutely lovely i think they're just little tea light holders look in here they are gorgeous and then i saw all the reduced easter stuff so i bought quite a few other bargains but i thought i'd just put them away put them straight in the cupboard and then get them out next year and it'll be like you know i've got brand new things for next to nothing so how good is that for one pound fifty i bought things for like 90p um really really cheap so some lovely easter bits from tk max so um yeah very happy i got those right i'm gonna go to the garden and show you the progress on the plants um near the greenhouse right so let's see how things are growing over here sprouting nothing's happening yet the geraniums haven't flowered yet but hopefully they will i've moved the others to a sunnier spot because someone suggested on here that they needed a lot more sunlight these ones are okay because they're at the front but it was the other ones that i was worried about so thank you if that was you um thank you for any plant tips that's doing really well whatever that is and then what else is going on oh i need to replace that because that's ruined sprouting sprouting that was the one from poundland i got um that one's doing well i repotted that i repotted a lot the other day actually into a bigger pot so hopefully they'll grow more that's looking good and these will kind of look the same and i put this in a bigger pot as well because all the roots were at the bottom and that seems to be growing quite well and just next to the greenhouse there's some beautiful roses look at these how gorgeous are they so beautiful and then behind the greenhouse look at all those flowers all the roses they're gorgeous and lee's just built this teepee thing for toby's beans that um this is kind of like a school project so he's put them on this bamboo and they might yeah hopefully they'll grow up that so they're doing really well and then over here where we've got our outdoor furniture I put the other big geranium plant there because it was in the shade a bit and I put too much water in it so I've emptied a bit of the water so hopefully that'll do well I don't know this is doing brilliantly though whatever that is and that was a pot no that was um one of the home bargains bucket things so we'll see how that gets on I only did that two days ago this one's looking good the little wildflowers and that's some more of the home bargains one because there was kind of too much for one bucket so i put some in there too these geraniums look better i think because they're in they've been in the sun for a couple of days and this lily is doing well so that should flower soon and the lavender seems to be growing as well so i repotted that into this um container well this plant pot from asda i love it so much but i can't get any more i keep checking the website but they don't have them so i think there's going to be some flowers on that soon and that is all the yeah, that's the plant update. What do you think, Rufus? What do you think, Rufus? Oh, hello. Hello, Rufus. I've got my new watch on. I love it. So cute. Hello. It's Thursday afternoon. It's about half past 12. And we've just had a really lazy morning, haven't we? <laughs> yeah. Toby's been doing schoolwork really well. Yeah. Shall we share in my bedroom? Yeah. Oh, yeah. We put the um, lights on. I've got a home bargains haul on Wednesday and I bought Toby some like neon lights. So we'll show you them in a minute. And we're just going to head out to Lidl. I haven't been to Lidl since before lockdown. And I want to get some coffee capsules, some fresh flowers and just have a little look around. You want a packet of crisps, don't you? Yeah, let's go and show you my room. OK, we're going to show you your room. Rufus is here. Rufus! Hello. We're just looking out the window and the weather is rubbish today. It's rained all morning. I think it's stopped now. But it's still um it's really cloudy out there. Yeah, I went on the trampoline today. Um and um What happened on the trampoline? Oh uh I and I I uh I done a flip and then um uh, I got my back really wet. Oh no, because the trampoline was all wet. So in here, this is Toby's bunk bed and these lights were from home bargains and they cost four ninety nine and they come with a remote oh. control. So you'll see them in the home bargains hall and you love them, don't you? Yeah, and you can um, make them flash as well. Yeah, you can. So there is all different things on this remote control. So there's green. Oh, and then we can go red. Oh, and then, oh, that looks good. And then oh, we've got white. Oh, oh blue. I know, but I, oh, hang on. White. Uh, 
No, you need to turn it off for white. Oh, there we go. Oh, there and we then go. you do the blue one. Toby put his shirts blue. here. That looks so good, doesn't it? Are you glad I got you those? They look purple. Pink. Oh, yeah, they look lovely. So we just wanted to quickly show you. Wow, look at orange. Looks so, is there orange as well? It matches that. Oh, it looks great, yeah, it does. Love it. Rufus, do you love them? Do you like them? <laughs> Hello. So nice. <laughs> I didn't know you could get orange. They're so nice. I didn't realise you could, they look really good. So we're gonna quickly go to Lidl and then we'll come back and I'll do a little haul and show you what I bought. And we just got back from Lidl. Whenever you go there, you can't just get what you need because you always come back with random things from the middle aisle. So I got a couple of those, which I'll show you in just a minute. Toby wanted some ice creams. So we got these honeycomb combs and I think you get four in there and they were £1.49 for those. Some Walker salt vinegar crisps. Toby was after some crisps and they were £1.69. And then he wanted these as well as a little treat. Choco Fins, crispy orange. And they were, just looking on my receipt, £1.39. Strawberries were £1.75 and they look lovely. There's 400 grams of strawberries in there. Let me just double check my receipt. Yeah, £1.75. Pepper armies were one ninety nine, and they're a pack of 10. They're mini ones. I love the look of these tomatoes, these like orange tomatoes. And I'll just have a look and see how much they were. On my receipt, where's the tomatoes? And they were £1.69, there's 250 grams. I bought four packets of these um, coffee capsules that go in the Nespresso machine, and they are really nice, but they're not too strong. They're strength five, it goes up to 12, but strength five is perfect, so I can have a couple of these in the morning. So I got four of those, and some coffee beans for Lee's coffee machine, and they're strength three, but they come in different strengths, I think, or maybe it's the same, I'm not sure. These were a really good price, 200 grams, and they were, let me find them on my receipt. Where have they gone? £1.72, which is brilliant. <coughs> what was £1.72? These coffee beans are a really good price. So at each and then the slow cooker we have got a slow cooker but it's really Wrecked. battered it is it's all scratched on the inside yeah it used to be my mum's um hang on toves so it used to be my mum's and Ew, it, we've had it for yeah. about 10 years so it needed to go i know maybe even longer this was 12.99 lee i thought it was 15 but it's actually 12.99 which is brilliant and you can do vegetables and things in them and they last well the other one lasted us Absolute year. So twelve ninety nine for that. I bought a couple of gin tins. Hortus, what's this one? Rhubarb and ginger. Rhubarb and ginger. Gin, that is so nice. And they're £1.19 each. I also got a couple of these. Uh, mojitos and woo-woos. They were 89p each because it's nice to just grab a drink when you want one um, rather than pouring. I don't know. I just quite like having a tin. It's just nice and convenient. And then um, some kitchen roll as well. The kitchen roll, let me see how much that was. Can you see kitchen roll on this receipt? Kitchen roll. Kitchen kitchen. roll. Oh, £1.59. Yeah. There, £1.59. Wow, £1 I think that is everything. Oh, oh, we've got some flowers as well, which and I'll that. show you. And look what Toby bought, Lee. Uh-oh. For Bestie. <laughs> this was... <laughs> I bought it. He bought it. It's like, I have to buy it for Bestie. Um, so we got it for Bestie. So this is a It zoo. was £16. £16.66. £16, that one there. One one? Six. £16.66. £16.66. There. Ooh, and yeah so really bestie cool. got a cat house for bestie all oh, that's house. the <laughs> dishwasher done so we will set that up for hey. bestie a bit later and i bought some peonies as well i keep seeing these on instagram and all the house accounts and i haven't i've never bought peonies before i think they look beautiful and when i saw them in Lidl, i thought oh go on then i'll treat myself to some bunches so they were three pounds 39 a bunch and they smell amazing i think they do or is that something else no, they smell beautiful. They smell like roses. So I've got three bunches of these and they were £3.39. And I'm going to put them all together and make them look lovely. And then I just wanted some white flowers. So I got two bunches of these ones and they are chrysanthemums. Chrysanthemums. Chrysan How do you say it? Chrysanthemums. Chrysanthemums. <laughs> <laughs> um, they were £2.19 each. And look at the cat house. Toby's just put it all together. Bessie is going to love own. that all by yourself. That's brilliant. Well done. I'm reading the instructions. Really? That's so good. Bessie's going to love it. it. Oh. Ah. <laughs> and Toby spent his pocket money on that, which I thought was very, very sweet because I said oh, we didn't really need it. And he's like, no, we have to get it. Bessie's going to love it. So we're going to put that this on top of the fridge freezer up here 
Bessie's got his other one there, but um, we're going to move that. And I think Bessie likes his house. He's just been in to explore. Is that good, Bestie? <laughs> and the last thing I bought was this hydrangea plant. It's massive. It's beautiful. And that was six ninety nine, which is such good value. And I've just come outside to the garden and the weather is lovely. It's really warm. It's been raining, so the grass... Oh, is that a fly in front of me? The grass is going to be very happy and the plants don't need watering today, but it's just beautiful. It feels really warm as well. And I'm going to end this video here. So I hope you enjoyed this vlog. We did a, there was a little haul. What else was there? Um, I showed you all oh, pound stretcher things and some TK Maxx bargains. So I hope you enjoyed this video. <laughs> bargains, loads of bargains. Um, so thanks for watching. If you did enjoy it, give the video a like and make sure you subscribe. subscribe. That's right. Wait, what's the goal? How many? Oh, likes. I don't know. How many do you reckon? How many? 1,000. Oh, I don't think we'll get 1,000. Yeah, we've got 950 or something. We've got quite a lot before. Okay, this video's got to get to, hopefully. 1,000. Mm, let's go for 700. 700? We would it like is, um, 700 no, likes. And come over to Instagram in the meantime. I'm Kate McCabe and my house account is Kate's Homely Home. They'll be linked in the description. Along with Friday's £100 pound land haul that went on. Wow, and pounds. I know, it's a big haul, biggest haul ever. And oh. and an Asda haul and some other home bargains one as well. So I'll link my previous hauls and videos in the description in case you want to catch up. And I'll speak to you Wednesday morning at 8 a.m. And it's going to be a home bargains haul. So I'll speak to you then. Take care. See you. Bye.